once in a while you come across a little gem in your own neighborhood and you just can't help it but share it with everyone. I am here at Clancy's, a 25 years institution, amazing coffee in White Rock, downtown in beautiful British Columbia. So the owner, Shalina, has been here for four years. And let me talk to you about customer service. So you enter and then you see this lovely, amazing, inviting little place. And there's names on the tables because people reserve in order to come for coffee here. And then she places their name on the table waiting for them. It's not just a reserve, reserve gen, uh, generic sign. She puts the name of the people. So when you arrive here, you have a reservation, you see your name on the table. And then my husband was here with, with friends and she's got these amazing little teacup um, and she serves coffee in them too. And she's got a wide variety of them. And one of our friends says, um, oh, this looks just like my mom had. And then he looks at the name at the bottom. He said, it was a different name though, but it looks just like it. So she hears that, she finds the name through the coffee cups and she exchanges coffee so that he could have coffee in the actual name of the coffee cup with just like with the same pattern uh, that his mom used to have. So this is great customer service. The owner was attentive and and you know what? We came back and and that's what you need to do nowadays when you want to keep your business open. So as an entrepreneur, what is the little extra that you are doing and that will make customers come back? What is the special that your customer will come back to see you for. So find a way in your own business, how can you add on personalized touch like that and make your services so inviting, just like Shalina at Clancy's Coffee in White Rock.